G.H. Spoilers tease that after years of concealing and running his secret criminal empire, the full extent of Sonny's criminal activities has finally been exposed. Through a thorough and prolonged investigation, authorities uncovered a vast network of illegal operations that Sonny had been hiding for years. Indisputable evidence, including documents, financial records, and testimonies from former associates who turned against him, clearly indicated that Sonny was not only involved in arms dealing and money laundering, but also led several unresolved murder cases. As a result, the public was shocked as the horrifying details of how Sonny conducted his operations were widely reported by the media. The image of Sonny Corinthos as a wealthy, powerful man, once respected by many, has completely crumbled. The community, which once saw him as a successful businessman and a patron, now views him as a dangerous criminal who must pay for his crimes. In court, as all evidence was presented before the public and the jury, a tense and heavy atmosphere enveloped the courtroom. With each crime detail revealed, Sonny's expression shifted from confidence to despair. Those who had supported and protected him now faced the harsh reality about the person they once admired. Eventually, Sonny Corinthos was convicted on multiple serious charges, marking the end of a criminal era that affected many lives in the community. With his imprisonment, a clear message was sent. No one, not even the most powerful, can escape the punishment of the law when committing crimes. Sonny is undergoing a severe mental health crisis after taking pills provided by Ava, unbeknownst to him that they had been tampered with intentionally. With incorrect dosages and tampered ingredients, these medications not only failed to stabilize his mood, but also caused unwanted psychological reactions, further destabilizing him. Due to the sudden and unpredictable change in behavior, Sonny lost the ability to control himself. He became paranoid and anxious, frequently obsessed with the idea that everyone around him was conspiring against him. Sonny's condition worsened as he was unable to distinguish reality from his paranoid thoughts, leading to impulsive and dangerous actions. His family and friends, deeply concerned, were no longer able to intervene or assist him during this difficult phase. Medical and psychological experts made the tough decision to admit him to the Ferncliff Psychiatric Facility, where he could be closely monitored and receive professional care. Here, Sonny is being treated in a safe environment, helping him gradually recover his mental stability and health, while also figuring out how to effectively manage the side effects of the medication. This event is not only a personal tragedy for Sonny, but also a painful lesson about the strong impact of inappropriate medical interventions, highlighting the importance of strictly following medical guidelines in mental health treatment.